It's really important that we have enough clearance around our units to move that air through and get as much efficiency out of the unit as possible. So when we install a unit in your home, we need a nice big gap behind it, at least 300 mil, and then we need at least a meter in front of it to get all that air out and away from the unit. Otherwise we get a problem with cycling. So if we have a barrier in front, like a wall or in a tight uh, alleyway or corridor, then the air can come out, deflect around the back and get sucked back into the back again. And it cycles around. And as it ha this happens, the actual unit itself starts to freeze. As we're taking 10 degrees out of the ambient air temperature, it's then being recycled back into the back and it will just get colder and colder and colder. Other things we need to take into consideration are boundaries. So it needs to be a meter away from a neighbor's boundary as a minimum. And then we have to take into consideration noise calculations. So we will work out how much noise this will make from a neighbor's window and we'll do all the calculations to make sure that your unit is in the best place for your house and meets all permitted planning development legislation.